Hey guys, it's time for another Trigger Pull Thursday, and today we're going to take a look at my favorite revolver, and that is the Smith & Wesson 686 Plus. Now I have this loaded with snap caps. This has a factory trigger in it. Uh, eventually, I'm going to put a Wolf spring kit or, or some kind of aftermarket uh, spring kit in this to loosen it or lighten the pull. But for now, we are taking a look at the factory trigger setting. Now, I believe that the double action pull is going to be more than 12 pounds, which is what my uh, scale will measure. But we will find, you know, test it and see. Oop, I guess I got to press ready first. Oh. It didn't say over, so I guess that was 11 pounds, 1.7 ounces. Let's uh, try again. Ten pounds, 12.5 ounces, and let's go for a third. Nine pounds, fifteen point eight ounces, and average ten pounds, ten point zero ounces on the double trigger pull. Now let's check the single action. Clear that out. Okay, single action. Two pounds, thirteen point four ounces. Two pounds, fourteen point seven ounces. Third and final pull. Two pounds, fifteen point four ounces. And average, two pounds, fourteen point five ounces. So I like that double or single action pull. I just thought the uh, double was a little heavier than that, but. I am wrong occasionally. <laughs> so there we go. The Smith & Wesson 686 for this Trigger Pull Thursday. So that's all I got for you today. Thanks for watching and we will talk to you later.